We'll guide you through how to live stream with the Streamlabs mobile app. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. Streamlabs is one of the best apps you can use for streaming from your phone. To get started, go and download it from your phone store and open it up. Now, what you can do is come down to the bottom. I found the best thing to do is go and log in with the platform you wish to stream with, whether that's Switch or YouTube. I'll use YouTube and tap there. Then what we can do is go and sign in. You need to go and give Streamlabs some different permissions. Here we are. So you can go and use Streamlabs vertically, or you can go and use it horizontally as well. If you go to the top left, there are lots of different options here you can go through. So you can go through each of these and get in depth, but to go and get streaming, it's not essential. What we can do is go out of here. In the top right, you can go and press on this icon and you can switch between your different cameras. You can go and press on scenes in the top right and you can press add first scene. You can go and see the different pre-made templates here. You can press custom and make your own. You don't even have to use one if you don't want to as well though. I'll go and select this one here and press create new scene. You can see how it looks and adjust it and press save in the top left. You'll need to set up the horizontal one as well. In the bottom left, you can flip the camera and mute audio, view the chart over to the right and see the event list. And then when you're ready, you can press go live. What you could do is go and stream your camera or your screen and we can press next. Then what you need to do is you need to go and switch this on and you can choose where you're broadcasting to. I'm going to set this to a create event option. If you've got one already, you can use that, but create is going to be the best probably. Then you can press next, give it a title, a description and fill out the rest of the options. At the bottom, you can go and set the quality. For the bit right here, you can tap on it and I find 3500 to be pretty good. Then what we can do is go and press go live. We're now going to be going live. I'll go and press got this here. Then what I can do is press this button and I can press microphone on as I want to be speaking. We can then press start broadcast. Now we're going to be going live. So I can come out of this, I'll press close and we're gonna be streaming our phone screen. When you're finished, you can come back to the app and what you can do is go and tap the screen, press stop at the bottom and you can then go and make sure end live session is selected and press stop. 